Who needs a treadmill when you can do cardio at the office? Hey, it's Coach Becky here, and today I'm going to show you the best cardio move that you can do to really work your entire body and get that heart rate pumping. But hey, did you know there are plenty of exercises that you can do right in the office that will help you shape and tone your body while working that cardio? And hey, it's with these awesome sliders, and we want to give these to you for free along with those workouts that you can do. So make sure you go check out that pinned comment down below to grab your set of sliders and start working on that dream body. All right, let's hop in. I wanna show you this exercise. All right, so the time has come. I know you wanna know what that best exercise is to get that cardio in your office. And yes, it is a burpee, but we're gonna do it different today. We're gonna to take it with the sliders. Now, why is this move? I know it's dreaded by many, but it is such a good move because you work your entire body. You work everything, not just cardio, but you are strengthening your shoulders, your core, your back, your legs, all of it. So you can get more done in less time than if you just sit here and do individual exercises for each body part. So let's go ahead and dive into this exercise. I want to show you how to do it and some variations of it for your fitness level. So we want to take the sliders, we want to put them right under. So I'm kind of putting the the this just front part of my foot on the slider. So not my whole foot, just the very front kind of in the center of it, right? So as we come down and slide back, we wanna make sure it stays under our foot. So the first piece of this is we're gonna squat down and put our hands onto the floor. So you really wanna focus on using your legs here. Sometimes people just kind of round over. Use those legs to get down nice and low. Get those hands on the floor. From there, we're gonna kick back into that plank. And from here, now you can add a push up into this and come back up, right? If the push-up's too much, you can always take the push-up out. We're gonna drive those knees back in and then come all the way up to standing. Squeeze your butt at the top, all right? So let me show you a variation where you can take that push-up down to your knees. So you could come down, okay? Kick it out to that plank, core stays tight, hips <laughs> stay down, drop those knees, hit your push-up here, back up, right? Drive it in come up. Now, that was a little bit of slow motion, <laughs> so let's speed it up. Let me show you what this looks like real time so you know how to put it in and get that cardio in, all right? So we're gonna take it down, kick it out, hit that push up, come back up, drive it in, up, okay? One more on the knees, drive it out, drop those knees, push up down, bring it up, in and up. Woo, I'm already getting out of breath and I think I just did about four of those. <laughs> so that's how you can really get that cardio in, work that entire body. And hey, if you really want to shape that entire body, burn off the fat, get that cardio working, make sure you guys check out those free sliders just like this that we have for you, okay? Check out that pinned comment down below. You'll get free sliders and more exercises and more workouts that you can do to really help you reach those goals. So make sure you check out that pinned comment. And of course, thanks for joining me. Can't wait to see you next time. 